should go take a look at that research station. Spider cops on the job. Come hell or high water, the job gets. Nope, 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 nope. She never admitted, but the chief was warming up to Spider Cop. His casual disregard for by the book thinking was a breath of fresh air. She'd come around someday. me a message about these before he left for Europe. Pete, hey, I need a favor. My mom's pet project was research stations that could benefit the public. Now, I launched them, but now that I'm away, Oscorp's gonna shut them down unless they prove their value. I was hoping you could watch them. I left details in each one. Thanks, man. As long as they're here, it's like a part of my mom is, too. Well, it's not gonna pay the bills, but... It sounds like it means a lot to him. I'll do what I can to help. I've got a couple stations measuring air pollution. The idea is to catch the, oh, what's the word, contaminants before they reach toxic levels. Between you and me, I think Oscorp wants this to fail because it might show they're polluting. The amount of polycyclic hydrocarbons in the air is way too high. And rising. If it keeps getting worse, people could die. Particles are concentrating in trouble spots. Like mini clouds of smog. I'll swing through them and get samples, then trace them to the source. Nasty as they are, I gotta swing right through those clouds. to be visible to the naked eye. The level of toxins must be up there.
getting some good stuff. Well, good samples of bad stuff, anyway. Got it. from a tailpipe. <laughs> I must be freaking these people out. Oh, what else is new? Toxins coming from two types of cars and a faulty smokestack. I better get photos. I'm usually web swinging. Great light on that one.
Best smokestack picture I ever took. The Department of Environmental Protection will take it from here. Maybe I should make a green spider costume for Earth Day. Well, Harry Station just stopped a public health crisis. Oscorp's gonna have a hard time arguing it's not useful. Spider-Man, Shocker has escaped, and now he's robbing a bank on East 31st. What happened? I thought he was behind bars. He was, but one of the guards just walked up to his cell and released him, then gave him his suit back. I knew Shocker was working for someone. What did you get out of the guard? Wish I could ask him, but he's dead. Whoever made him release Shocker didn't want any loose ends. Damn. Looking at the security footage, the guard was in some kind of trance. And it might have been the lighting, but it looked like his eyes were glowing. Well, that's creepy. Okay, I'll see what I can get out of Shocker when I get to the bank. Sounds like they've quietly established a power base in the vacuum left by Fisk. A vacuum I created by putting Fisk away. Jameson was right. The demons are my fault. But what were you supposed to do? Let Fisk keep godfathering? Are you okay? You sound even mopier than usual. I think I might have just lost my job. The city, Norman actually, pulled our funding. Oh, Pete. I'm sorry. If Harry were here, he could talk some sense into his dad. You'll find another source. Your work's too important. Thanks, MJ. Talk to you soon. Pursuit in progress. Backup requested. Officers in Murray Hill. Stand by for further instruction. before they end up in driver's ed videos. No see. Here's your stuff. Well, that's just rude. Reinforcements. 
I guess this is what they call organized crime. worse commutes. Careful with my adoring public. Armed robbery in progress. Converge on Grand Central. Over. Gotta be a special kind of crazy to rob a storefront in the city Spider-Man protects. Oh man, thanks. The police will take it from here.
Okay, Pete. This lab has feeders to lure in birds and analyze their droppings. Yeah, that's right. I got an MBA to test bird poop. <laughs> Seriously, though, you probably know that birds carry diseases that affect people, and we need to make sure they're healthy. You know, I really wish I was there to hear your finest toilet humor on this one. Uh-oh. The pigeons are infected with a serious strain of avian flu, and it's already mutated to a form that can spread to humans. Okay, Harry's lab had everything I needed to make a vaccine. Gotta spread it fast, or the pigeons will be like rats with the bubonic plague. My best bet's dispersing it at three major migration points. Luckily, the station told me where they are. First migration point's in a park. Birds there should spread the vaccine to their buddies. Pigeons put up with me swinging through their territory, so I owe them a favor. I bet the Avengers never have bird poop missions. Here we go. The vaccine's airborne, so I'll just spray it into the trees. Okay, one down, two to go. The spray, the spray won't bother people or other animals, but it'll cure the pigeons. Or trigger the zombie pigeon apocalypse. Spider-Man in the flesh?
I've got a business proposition. And one more left. I wonder what Jameson will make of this. Spider-Man spreads chemtrails seems like a good bet. I like helping animals. They don't call me a menace or shoot at me or anything. I wonder if it'd be stretching things if I added veterinarian to my resume. Sorry, spider emergency. Okay, that should work fast. I'd better scan some pigeons to make sure. Did it. No zombie pigeons. Spider-Man, over here. Hey Stevie, check it out. <laughs> 